hello and welcome back to my channel Remy's recipe today I'll be ma making Lothar's tamisu so come and join me let's do it together guys so what I've got here is two cups of cold water I've got vanilla here I've also got cream fresh 300 gram I've got um, sugar as well if I need those for decoration I've got 500 grams of mascarpone I've also got finger sponge here and yes I could not find the Lothas biscuit but very similar to the Lothas biscuit I've got from my local supermarket I usually get them as well so let's do it so it depends how intense you want your tamasu to be so here I'm going to add two tablespoons of coffee and make sure the water is cold no hot water no warm water so water have to be 100% cold so I'm adding my two tablespoons of coffee and I'm going to stir them here so once I stir this I'm going to leave it on the side and I'll be moving to my next step So here's the next step. I've got here 500 gram of mascarpone each contains 250 gram. So all together that makes 500 gram and 500 grams of mascarpone. I'm going to place it in the bowl here. Next, I'm going to add 300 grams of creme fraiche. It's not double cream, it's thicker than double cream. So if, if you're gonna make my exact recipe, make sure you get creme fraiche. And I'm adding here 300 grams of creme fraiche. As you can see here, it's very thick than the double cream or extra double cream, whatever they call it. So now I'm going to add my sugar and it's less than a half a cup of sugar that I'm adding because I don't want my tamasu to be extremely sweet and I'm going to be adding my vanilla. If you don't have this vanilla you can use the powdered vanilla, it's perfectly fine, is what you prefer. If you don't like vanilla then you can substitute for rose water, one te uh, teaspoon. So now I'm going to blend this for a good three to four minutes. Mix all together this for three to four minutes. We just want the sugar and the cream just to mix well together. So now you see this is thick and creamy. I'm going to set this second step on the side. Now it's time to do the third step. Here, I'm going to crush my biscuit so what I'm going to do, I'm going to blend my biscuits here. This must be my, my favorite dessert of 2020. So it's a lockdown dessert, I guess. So here my biscuit is crushed and I'm going to leave it on the side as well is perfectly done biscuits so now it's our final step here so I've got the finger sponge I'm going to dip it in the coffee I've got the biscuits and the thick cream for the tamasu so yeah let's do this guys so I'm going to dip each finger sponge and then place it in the tray 
and don't hold it too long please you just dip it you take it out you dip it you take it out because otherwise it's going to be too soggy and remember guys i believe this is the second time i'm repeating do not use warm water or hot water make sure the water is cold water and i don't mean cold from the fridge So now I've laid them nicely, I'm going to add the cream, which is the second layer. Make sure that you cover if like you cover all over the biscuit with cream and you make them the same layer, the same level. We don't want it to be one side thicker than the other side, so we make it perfectly the same layer. And now the third step will be the biscuits, the crushed biscuits. I'm going to cover all over the cream with crushed biscuit. This is what gives the taste. And then what what we're gonna do you're just gonna repeat the second step is the same you're gonna put um, finger biscuits cream and then finally which is what I'm doing now the crushed biscuit you cover all over the tamasu Now I'm going to make them all even by pressing my hands on the tray just to make them all even. Press them down nicely and neatly and make sure that you keep in the fridge for 24 hours plus. Like leave it overnight so if you make it say for example today at 6 o'clock you probably take it out tomorrow six or even after six tomorrow six in the evening so please do for more than 24 hours if that's 24 hours actually what well, i said i hope i was right so anyways So this is the outcome for the Lathar's Tamasu and I hope you guys enjoyed watching my recipe. If you liked any of my recipes or you want to see more recipes from Remy's Recipes, please share, like and subscribe, share with your family members and friends and I hope you to see you next time for a new delicious recipe. Thank you for watching have a good day.